Hey everybody, um, I realized it's been a while since I did a video. <clears throat> Thanksgiving is next week, so I um, just wanted to take a moment to let everybody know that, well I just want to remind everybody that <clears throat> you know, Jessica Moore's journey. Like, this is my story, okay? This is my journey. And, you know, the foundation, Purple with a Purpose, and the website, purplewithapurpose.org, you know, everything that that is going to, you know, do and the, pur you know, the purpose of that, that is for several other you know, head conditions that I don't want to scare people away. Um, I want everybody to know, even if it's been said in other videos, that although I've had to have five surgeries to date, they've been successful. And yes, it's been a long recovery. And, you know, I'm experiencing some pain in another area that was already kind of talked about in, um, before my last surgery that we would just, again, it's like, let's get through this and deal with it when we need to deal with it. So I'm just trying to remain positive every day for all of you out there that are suffering or maybe suffering and don't know what to do or on the fence of what, you know, what to do. And I'm telling you, I am in such a better place than I was four years ago, two years ago, but I'm not going to sit here and say I'm a hundred percent better. Like, Oh, the old Jessica's back. I mean, trust me, I wish I was, um, it just takes time. Again, this is my story, my journey. So right now, I'm dealing with a review from the disability company because they think maybe I should be back at work and there could be stuff that I could be doing, which I understand it's all part of the process. Um, I would give anything to be back to a normal life and to get up, get dressed, put my makeup on and go back to a job where I could socialize with people and be productive and use my brain and my skills. Um, I have a hard time just doing I don't know. I mean, I really don't do anything, but I'm trying to stay calm and not have anxiety about stuff. Like, why am I not here yet? Or why am I not here yet? So, from the surgical standpoint, you know, the surgeon sends in the latest report of, oh, we saw Jessica, she's doing well, we think this, 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 and you know, that's great, but I'm under the care of my neurologist. And so we're talking about the newest and latest problem area. And so it's kind of funny because the surgeon says, you know, increase daily activity, wean off medication. And um, that's great. However, I... And, and, and from the information that he's been given, because we just deal with, well, how are you feeling from the surgery I performed in August? But then when I see my neurologist, when I talk to my neurologist, I go into detail of, okay, well, this is what's happening now. So she's actually increased my medication and I'm not, I, I'm like, can I do physical therapy? And it's, the answer is still no. You can walk around your block now it's every other day and you're overdoing it because, you know, I tell her like, well, this is what I did. And then, you know, I was in bed for two days and this is, I'm starting to have this certain feeling and it's new and 
I'm kind of scared only because it's new and I'm, I'm not going to get into it with you guys because it's boring, but basically long story short for my neurologist who I'm under her care on a daily basis, basically. So if anything goes wrong, I call her. So I have a chance that I'm going to lose my disability income and you know what it is what it is um it's just money <laughs> I mean the only reason why I'm getting emotional is because Christmas is coming up um Ashley's in college and I worked so hard at my company. <laughs> I'm sorry. Anyway, I want to stay focused on the positive. And that is the beautiful website that my husband did. Hopefully getting tax-exempt tax status through the IRS. So people will donate to the foundation so the foundation can help others that don't have insurance or are out of work and don't have income. I'm just very passionate about helping people that are suffering with chronic daily head pain. Um, I'm grateful for like I said, where I'm at at this point in my journey. And I believe that every day is a blessing. I appreciate friends that are reaching out and supporting me and just saying hi and checking in. It means a lot because this is very isolating. And, um, I'm grateful for my family. I'm grateful that the sun is shining today. Anyway, so, I'm grateful for all of you who have shared the website link. It means a lot. Um, I just want good to come out of all of this. So I tell myself every day, and I've been telling myself that for two years, five surgeries, and all the recovery, that good will come out of this, and that's all I want to raise awareness and let people know that this is real and we may look good on the outside well I don't but you're really dying on the inside um, I hope everybody has a wonderful Thanksgiving I'm so excited to see Ashley she's coming home in a week and we're all going to sit down to a yummy turkey dinner. And that's it. I mean, we're just going to hang out, obviously, at home. And just have a nice holiday. I hope you all do with your loved ones. And I will do a video soon. Bye.